All right, here we are in the little room. Doing a walk about here. We've got some cool stuff sitting on these tables. The little room has a lot of neat stuff, a lot of cool stuff. These are all razor blades. We got the uh, cool bets over there. I didn't mean to film that guy's butt, but it happened. Got some cool knives over there. These are red beard blades. You got some, hello. They're very friendly. We got some stuff. Looks like you got some Tuya knives over here. This is a Tuya booth. That makes sense to have Tuya knives. How you doing, man? Good. I've been testing a lot of these in the Apex group. They're pretty good. Yeah, the Hive, I think, is the one I have right now. You uh, probably got an old of the uh, Big Belly then. It's at my house. I haven't opened it yet. Okay, well, let me show you these. Yeah, uh, show me that. We got the Big Belly. The regular price on it is $269, or $279, I think. Um, shows a little bit different, $10 different. But it's M390 and carbon fiber. Well, they just come out with these. I only had 10 for Blade Show. They got a uh, Blade Show. 2022 on the clip. Oh, that's cool. And but these are going to be the new big bellies with G10. It's still an integral. Ah, cool. But they went to G10 instead of carbon fiber, and they went to 154 cm instead of M390. I like 154. That makes it 160 bucks instead of 270. 160 bucks. 159 actually on the website. So these will be out soon. I'm waiting for the big shipment. And. Sorry. Oh, no problem. I'm just steady away from you. Oh, no, you stay. I'll, I'll be over here on the corner. So the only difference between this one and the premium one is the materials. They're yep. both, are both integrals. They both have reversible clips. Okay, perfect. And I like that yours, guys, comes in these cool uh, cases. Yeah, all of the That's higher awesome. knives. I mean, the cheaper ones, like the Bruiser, still come in the box. Yeah. But like, but don't, don't buy the... I mean, you can't buy the cheap stuff, but I mean... That case is sweet. They, they are not. I've had so many knife makers come over and want to buy my cases. Yeah. And, they're, uh, they're and want, they're, they want to order them. They're waterproof too, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah we're, we're in Atlanta. You kind of need that. Yes. Yeah, so same same thing in Kentucky. We got so much moisture there. Yeah. Well, it's, yeah got, it's got that rubber seal in there. And this yeah. presses down into that rubber seal. See, that's cool. Yeah. Completely waterproof. Yeah, make sure you come to the Tuya booth or order online, right? Yes, uh, Tuya, I didn't realize you were, uh, are you live? Yeah, I'm, I'm live. I didn't even realize. I'm I not live, I'm just filming. Well, I guess that's good because I didn't get nervous. Yeah, no, you're fine, you're fine. <laughs> Until now. I barely even filmed you, it's mostly. Yes, the web website is tuyanifeus.com. Tuyanifeus.com. Not knives, yes. knife. Oh, to your knife. sorry. Tuyanifeus.com. It's okay. It's my fault. Like our email is to your knives. Oh, uh, okay. Email. So people well, my, like myself confuse the email and the website. Well, check it out. I just did a. I just did this one. I, yeah, I like the way it felt. It's got a really deep hollow grind. Hey, see you, buddy. Yeah. And I like that the pivots are like the honeycomb shape too. Yeah, the designer insisted on uh, having that uh, hex shaped pivot. And they got rid of the lanyard hole that was on the version 2 because it was a circle right in the middle of these. Well, they put oh. the lanyard uh, hole in the back space. Yep. I noticed that. People either hate lanyards or love it. Yeah. I, I like them. And really, it don't matter to me either way, but. I don't like having the hole in some of the knives. It kind of takes away from the aesthetic. Yeah, I like I like when they're hidden like that. Yeah. It makes it a little tougher to thread in, but you know, once you do that, who cares? Right. Well, thanks for letting me look around. Hey, this was, I didn't realize you guys were here. I was looking for you over there. Oh, uh, was you? Yeah, the last three years we've been here in the ballroom. Um, I, I'm constantly hot. I sweat a lot. And it's, I know. it's much hotter, hotter in the big room. It is. It is. Really yeah, stay here in the corner. It's nice. They, they offered me a spot in the bedroom yeah. uh, last year, and I just couldn't do it. 
Well, thank you very much, guys. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate it. Yeah. Those guys are awesome. Go check them out. To your knives. Woo, look at the size of these guys. Those are cool. That canoe will take you across the river. <laughs> wow. All you slip joint guys right there. I like that green. Look at those pipes. Wow. Lots of materials. Oh, sorry. Cool little fixies here. Look at that. Would you look at it? Would you look at it? That's a cool tactical knives there. More materials. This, this booth must be, uh, oh, you can play Hungry Hungry Hippo. I think I'm going to go visit Anthony. This is my boy Anthony. This guy. How's it going? How you doing? Did you pick up anything cool? I had to. Oh my God. <laughs> and that's in your pocket. You walk in circles. <laughs> Actually, it's not that heavy. Oh really? Wait, hold hold not it. That heavy. Hold is it. The, is the handle aluminum? It's titanium. Oh okay. But the blade is a chunk of D2. That's where the weight is. Yeah. That's a, that's a big ball. Of <laughs> a, I love it. That's a big ball. It's <laughs> <That's> crazy. <laughs> Sorry, thank you. But this is tactical everyday dad. I'm doing my walkabout. Uh, that thing is crazy. I like he, that. He's it's got these heavy. excellent knives. No, that. Yeah, hey, you gotta be a real man. To buy one, that one is made by Germans in Germany in house. Oh, and I'm still learning it, but it's got this little wheel here that lets you unlock it and adjust the details. Okay, so yeah, I was even confused. Too. I was like, oh, and it comes with a pin to make it a fixie or lock it shut, but yeah. put it in your pocket. It kind of disappears. Put it in the pocket. It, 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 it disappears. You don't really notice it. That's cool though. Isn't it? it is. And they only made 250, and this is number two. I get one thing yet. Not yet. Ah, uh, you got it. Today's. I might, I might go walk around. Today's deal day. It's not gonna lie. Like the ones and stuff that I want to sort out in like two seconds. Oh, I know. I didn't even bother going to like the Arius booth to film that or Demco. I stayed away. I, I, I finally hit up them the other day and shot the AD-22, and I found out that they were AD-20.5 and 3D. They have a 22? AD-22 now. Uh, I don't know. If you want to see one, go to the other side, the OG Goat. There's a guy that has one. Okay. It's sweet. I got to talk to Christina and see what's going on. He's one of my favorites. But make sure you come to the Ted's booth here. Lots of awesome right. knives. The wood he does is fantastic. So we're dropping leftovers Tuesday night. Leftovers Tuesday night? Leftovers Tuesday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. On, on the website? Uh, yes, June 7th. For the guys that... June 7th, leftovers. Uh, there better not be leftovers, though. This thing is sweet. The wood you guys do is fantastic. That's Koa. Hawaiian wood. Koa, okay. You hear that? Andrew at Hawaiian Gear, they're coming for you. There's mango wood in that one. Mango wood. The most exotic of woods. <laughs> that feels great. Thank you. And what's the green one? What, what's the green? Mango as well. Just dyed green. Just dyed green. Okay. Man, that's cool. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Safe travels home. Oh, of course. When do you guys leave? Tomorrow. Tomorrow morning. And then it's three days to go home. Yeah. Stevie, though, has got about five days. Right. So he drops you guys off and keep going? Yeah, he goes to California to drop us off, and then Washington. He's got the longest drive of all. But he's having fun. Yeah. But thank you, guys. It's a cool stuff over there. There's an Arius just sitting right there. Two of them. Two Arius. Nobody got him yet? Huh? 
They're they're prime too. I can't I can't buy one, but okay. Yeah, they're, but they're the fact that they sold out over there, they might not know these are here. Yeah, yeah. Come over here and get them, guys. Those are fantastic. The second room, that's the secret, right? Yes. <laughs> find, the, find the deals and the secrets. If people knew these were here, <laughs> how much are they? Uh, they were both like special edition. I, 20 bucks? This one's no. Magnified. <laughs> I'm just so kidding. Like, yeah, the Magnified, I think you said 1400 roughly. Okay. Uh, on this one, this I one think one. it's a Sprint Run, it's in my car to... 17 okay. or something. That sounds like a thing. Come get these two guys. I don't think people know they're here, otherwise they'd be gone. I'll start telling people. Yeah, yeah, let them know. We'll, we'll get you some commission. <laughs> I don't need that. I just want you guys to do awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Appreciate it. Oh, and I got one of those. Oh, yeah? It's a great night. I love the XL. It's a great night. But I'll tell people you got two. I'm yeah. surprised. Take these guys. Two, two areas is just sitting there. Ooh, we got some porch guys. Selling some wood. Got cool belts. Ooh. Cool, that Mario, look at that. That's cool stuff. Thank you. Awesome elementum right there. Did you do all this work? Uh, some of it, not all of it. My bosses do uh, <laughs> some of it. I do some of it. It's, uh, Blacktop Ruby. That's hilarious. That's awesome though. Thank you. Ah, the seat dogs. Those look great. Stove pipe right here. Oh, stove pipe. What did you do to the rat? That looks awesome. Oh yeah. Whoa. It's one of our biggest sellers and one of our most customized knives. It's awesome. I like the blood splatter though. Wow, these are... Come over here, guys. Get this stuff. That is cool. Sabenza. Yep. Wow, you got everything. Ah, the axles. Oh, yeah. I love those. Yeah, look at the handle. Thank you. Can I take one of these? Of course, man. Take anything. Bunch of stickers. Ah, bunch keep of a band aid handy. Yeah, man. Uh, look, Jason Brown, right there. Jason Brown. Right there. Yep. Get your graffiti. Thank you. Of course, thank you. That is cool. That's an awesome little pry bar. Cool little cleavers over there. Shiny. Shiny. So those guys do wood and oh sorry. Oh, look at that guy. Oops, sorry. Cool Lux, little OTFs. That guy's doing a big old battle song. Yes. Uh, look at these switch blades. Woo! Medfords. Lots of Medfords. Sorry, no questions, and I'm judging. Lots of cool stuff. Let's go look at some of these ballet songs. This guy's got skills, look at him. Woo! Welcome to the Squid Games. This guy's got a cool hat. Excuse me, gentlemen, sorry, sorry. Badly, badly. Look at these guys. I couldn't do it. Give it a spin. Woo, look at that. That's a ballet song for Hulk. Wow. 
That's awesome. I could not do that. I couldn't even do the little one. I basically can't do anything. Stuff. Hello. Thank you. Look at all this neat stuff. Oh, look. Chisel knives. Cool stuff. Scallywag tactical. We got the drawing table. Oh, knife ideas. Up there. Here's the chrome scales. No. Good. Ooh, there's the lava ones. I learned about you guys through uh, David at Orion Knives. He's doing all this cool stuff now. I really dig the uh, lava. That's really cool. You guys do awesome stuff. And the Legos seem to be popular. Yeah, the Legos and the frag goes pretty well. Yeah, that, that's cool. These are awesome. Oh, is it alright if I film? Okay, I didn't even ask, sorry. That's pretty cool. Can I hold one of these? I, I, I make, um, sorry, I do titanium ones. Jason Brown. That feels good. That feels really good. It's not my favorite build to do. Wow. Thank you. Oh, a bean? Ooh. I'm taking a lava one. Thank you very much. Ooh, sucks to be that guy. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's a 45 caliber muzzle loader. Oh, there. that is, oh. The, I just, the only part I don't make is the spring inside. But other than that, it's functional? Absolutely, 100%. Okay, that's officially the most badass thing here. I used to make these as far back as the 1600s, so it's not my idea, it's just my design. That's awesome, though. Thank you. What does something like that go for? 1500 that's not bad. It takes me about four days to make one. Wow. Come over here to Morris Knives uh, and buy me that. I'm not live. I'm just filming. That's all right. But that, that's that's cool. Thank you. Thank wow. you. Wow. Wow. Oh, and you were on a TV show. My dad. Oh, yeah. your dad. My dad. Yeah. I'm going to go check that out. I have Discovery. Yeah. Master of Arms. Yeah, it okay. was a... So Fortune Fire was Knives, 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 Swords, Swords, Knives, Knives, Swords, Knives, right? Yes. Master of Arms was a spin-off show that Discovery did where, like, it was crossbows, cannons, trebuchets. Oh, good stuff. All, all trebuchets are ancient awesome. weaponry. Yeah. yeah, okay. But because it had firearms in it, it only ran for one season because too many people complained that it's glorification of firearms. That's bullcrap. I know. Yeah, but this, uh, that's, that's fantastic. Thanks. Well, thank you. Yeah, have a great day. You too. Hey, are you yeah. right-handed or left-handed? Right. Here, put that in your right-hand pocket. Put all the other cards in your left. <laughs> oh, well. Is that a trick? <laughs> thank you. Have a great day. You too. Thank you. I think I just got hustled. But I'm not sure. It's cool just talking with these guys. Look at these, those are cool. Those are cool. Okay, let's go to the other side real quick. This is the little ballroom. There's cue ball. Walking around. There's cool, cool stuff. Let's wait for cue ball actually. Hey, there's a guy with two Ariuses over there. What? There's two Ariuses over there. For sale? Yeah. I'm not buying an Arius. That guy right there, the big guy, he's got two Ariuses. Ron's is fitness recording, so... Me too. Yeah. Want to come walk around with me? Yeah, where are you? We got Cuba. I did all this, so I'm just going to go do these guys. Oh, okay. Cuba's joining me for the walkabout. Hey, what's up, folks? Q 
cue ball is just living it up. These are cool. Those are cool. We got sanding. I'm still sanding. Let's see, we got kitchen knives. We already did the OG Goat. That's its own video. Uh, we got some premium oils. Oil? Put some oil? We got some cool leather craft. Mm -hmm. The slingshots. Yeah. Oh, that's right up your alley, buddy. Slingshots are yeah. cool. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, they're doing pictures, so. That's cool. That's cool. I'm going to come back here. All right, what's this? Cobra Tech. These are all out the fronts and out the sides yeah. and out the back and out the butt. <laughs> Just kidding. Wouldn't that be cool if you had one that you could deploy two blades out? Double deploy? That would be yeah. sweet. I wonder if they have like a, a Hellhound style blade. Yeah, get in there. We got Gonzo Knife Reviews here of YouTube. Gonzo Knife Reviews. Gonzo Knife. <laughs> Freaking Gonzo Knife Reviews just showed up. What is that? Is that a wild, grumpy grunt? Grumpy! <laughs> he's going to get mad and throw poop at me. He's going to throw mayo at you. Oh, he's going to throw mayonnaise. The worst. I'd rather have the poop. Look at that. Look at all that. Look at all of that. I bet these guys are doing a lot of business. But they don't sell Axial. That's cool stuff. And then here we have DLD VIP. Oh, they got good stuff though. Spear polish. Things about $5,000. I've never used it. They don't have the cheap Cobra Tech. These guys got the real deal. Yeah. I like the zombies. Thank you. Outbreaks are... Uh, which is the zombie? The fat one? So these are the Outbreak series. Oh. Uh, and the Exo set. It's pretty cool. <laughs> we got to dip around these. Nafs Landa. We got the Nafs. Alright, I think it's my last table here. 